Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. Let's look at EU based MIUI 12.0.5 port running on Xiaomi Poco F1. The ROM is also called as Astronaut Build. In this video, we will be discussing about day to day possibility of this ROM as well as for gaming. At the end of this video, we will discuss all cons and pros of this ROM. So, if you are new here, Please support my work by subscribing and liking the video. As usual, I'll be starting with about phone session. As you see, the ROM version is MIUL 12.0.5 EU stable build. The security patch they got is pretty old, means from last December 2020. The kernel they are using is Lorand 17.0, which is a performance based kernel. When it comes to security, the ROM does has all features including IR face unlock, fingerprint and more. The fingerprint works pretty faster here, as well as the face unlock. I didn't face any issue with any of these options. The next important thing here is about battery. As far I used, you are going to get 8 hours plus screen on time with above average gaming. Under theme session, you will get all themes from MIUI. You can choose any of them according to your likes. Quick access panel includes all tiles as same as MIUI 12 and they works pretty well. It does has the option to screen recorder. but Remember, it does not support internal audio plus microphone recording at a time. Leaving that behind, I didn't face any issues after enabling screen recorder. Everything was pretty smooth. Now I am going to open some applications. This way you guys can understand the RAM management and app opening animation bugs. that RAM management of this ROM is going to be the best out there. Even games like PUBG was there in RAM. So now let's quickly check safety net. The ROM does passes all safety net checks out of the box and device is Google Play Protect certified which makes this ROM eligible for using banking applications without any issues. When it comes to benchmarks, the Android 2 scores 3,44,000 plus. 
and Geekbench calls single core 491 and multi core 2120 which are pretty decent scores for Poco F1. The ROM does also got floating window option which works pretty great. So without waiting let's quickly get into gaming test. I'll be playing PUBG Shinnok Boot Camp with screen recorder and FPS enabled. You guys can see the performance of this ROM by analyzing FPS and gameplay. Meantime, let's talk about pros and cons of this ROM. First, let's start with pros. Number 1, the ROM does pass a safety net checks out of the box. Number 2, the device is Google Play Protect certified. Number 3, ROM is stable and based upon MIUI 12.0.5. And number 4, as far I tested, I never noticed any lags or jitters. It's all pretty smooth. Number 5, it already comes out with a performance boosted kernel. Number 6, above average experience of gaming by keeping battery consumption balanced. Number 7 and the last one, the look and feel of MIUI 12 experience. So what could be the cons? To be frank, I didn't notice any. Yeah, in case, I can say its screen recorder does not allow you to record internal audio and microphone. And it is not fully concentrated gaming ROM. The ROM is a daily driver plus a good gamer. And the last one is ROM is still in Android 10, which is almost the same case for all MIUI 12X series. Overall, the experience with this ROM was really great and highly recommended this ROM for who love to use MIUI. If you are planning to use this ROM, all download links are there in the description. Also, you can join my telegram channel for more support. So that's it guys. If you like my video, don't forget to give a like. Till see you with another video. Be safe and take care.